informed opinion about why I think we should help Canada become food secure before we move globally or across the seas. On October 12, 2014, the Toronto Star News published an article on how Canada might be headed into a food security crisis. Four million individuals in Canada, including 1.15 million children, experience some sort of food security. This means 1.6 Canadians are food insecure. It may not seem like too much, but that is a little over 5,000 people in Canada. What food security in Canada looks like. Food security is buying pop instead of milk because it is a lot cheaper than milk. Or not eating your lunch and saving it for dinner because you don't want to go hungry through the night. Nation rate for diabetes has risen from 3.3% in 1998 to 1999. This is from eating junk food. Junk food is not going to fill you up for very long, and it is going to decrease your energy level and decrease your health. While having a conversation with an example of how they were raising money with Jean Friday, where you paid $2 to wear jeans for the day. The money that was being raised was getting sent to Brandon to help people in communities out there buy food and supplies for people in need. Mr. Ingemeyer brought up the idea at a staff meeting to put a certain amount of money in a year to help out people and children in our school so we know exactly where the money is going. I was glad he told me this. He made my decision about helping Canada get on our feet first and get more kids care before going to different countries and helping them not knowing if the money is actually going where we need it to. Why not put our Canadian taxes into helping Canada? When you walk through the grocery store, you notice apples, oranges, and healthy food is much more expensive than buying a bag of chips. With someone on a tight budget, it's easier to afford the cheap drug food rather than, than the expensive healthy food. I think that is something that needs to change. Drug food should be more expensive than healthy food. Even though some Canadians have food available, it's not nutritious food, which is also part of being food insecure. My final opinion is Canada should help ourselves before helping others, putting our taxes to good use, helping Canada before other countries. Once we are food secure, it will be easier to help out other countries.